dear Homo sapiens, we've arrived on this earth just 50,000 years ago, and earth is estimated to have been formed 4.5 billion years ago. Yet we've made so much progress in such a short time. We've invented ways of communication so advanced. Just a touch of finger can make us see a friend mile away in a glance. We've made a rocket ship to go up to the moon and technology to see whether if it's gonna rain soon. We've made antibiotics to fight off bacteria and germs and made artificial fertilization in test tube with selected ovum and specific sperm. We've made city inside the sea but we've killed fish for free. We've chopped trees as much as we want to and killed wildlife to make leather for our shoe. We've chopped cows, buffalo, snakes, goat and what not just for the sake of the tongue's taste with ecosystem we've fought. But that's not all. We've also fought with each other to show off our nuclear power. Right now, as you hear my poem, there is a mass shooting somewhere on earth every single hour. So after all this, what did we even expect? We've screwed up so badly that we're facing COVID-19 pandemic as an after effect. Number of people are dying everywhere and families are being locked down with so much fear. Doctors and nurses are fighting the best, not having a single moment to breathe in peace or have a good rest. We challenge nature as if we are stronger. Now nature has challenged us back and we fear we might not last longer. But this is no time to blame China, Italy, US or France. It's time to come together and control death in advance. The time has come for us to stop being selfish, to stop fighting for our greed, because there are people more affected than you in this pandemic. You can do a lot of help by staying at home. If one person breaks a chain, you can save thousands lives all alone. Earth can fulfill everyone's need, but it's not enough to fulfill every man's greed. Let's use our brain for saving nature with our innovation, instead of killing, cutting, or filling our pockets with corruption. The world cries as many lose their family or spouse. But did we hear those cries when chopping 800,000 cattle each day in slaughterhouse? Homo sapiens in Latin means wise men. Let's be true to our name. Together we can end this pandemic even if we seem bound. Stay home, be positive. Together, all our small contribution counts.